Okay guys, welcome back to Mass Effect, and when we left off, we was on Eden Prime, it's been attacked. We're going to find out just why. Oh yeah, left control to crash and all that, but well, you just crash like this, like. Nobody can see. <laughs> Come on, that. There we go. Beautiful. Who said you could live? Hmm. Negative contact, Commander. This is the dig site. The beacon was right here. It must have been moved. By who? Our side or the Geth? Hard to say. Maybe we'll know more after we check out the research camp. You think anyone got out of here alive? If they were lucky. Maybe hiding up in the camp. It's just on the top of this ridge, up the ramps. Very good. That's where we'll be going then, Ash. Change of plan, Shepard. There's a small spaceport up ahead. I want to check it out. I'll okay. wait for you there. You know, Nihilus, no, considering everyone's under attack here, do you think going alone here is the best course of action? I'm just saying. Like, there may be a better way to deal with this. Let's go, team. Looks like they hit the camp hard. It's a good place for an ambush. Keep your guard up. It's the husks. Oh god, they're still alive. What did the Geth do to them? I don't really want to throw a grenade, but okay. Rusty. Uh, R is grenade. Oh yeah, F. I was trying to do something like mid fight and it's just like failed miserably. <laughs> oh well. It's gonna take more than that though to put me down. Don't you worry. Okay, let's open it. Uh, okay. Boom. <laughs> Super easy. Humans. The mini game on console is actually a lot different. Hurry, close the door. I think the mini games on back. PC are a lot better, actually. Don't worry, we'll protect you. Thank you. I think we'll be okay now. It looks like everyone's gone. You're Dr. Warren, the one in charge of the excavation. Do you know what happened to the beacon? It was moved to the spaceport this morning. Manuel and I stayed behind to help pack up the camp. When the attack came, the Marines held them off long enough for us to hide. They gave their lives to save us. No one is saved. The age of humanity is ended. Soon, only ruin and corpses will remain. Did you notice a Turian in the area? I saw him, the prophet, leader of the enemy. He was here before the attack. Oh, yeah? That's impossible. Nihilus was with us in the Normandy before the attack. He couldn't have been here. I I'm sorry. Manuel's still a bit unsettled. We haven't seen your Turian. We've been hiding in here since the attack. Can you tell me anything about the beacon? It's some type of data module from a galaxy-wide communications network. Remarkably well-preserved. It could be the greatest scientific discovery of our lifetime. Miraculous new technologies, groundbreaking medical advances. Who knows what secrets are locked inside? We have unearthed the heart of evil. Awaken <laughs> oh the beast. Oh my god. 
unleashed the darkness. Manuel, please. This isn't the time. What's wrong with your assistant? Manuel has a brilliant mind, but he's always been a bit unstable. Genius and madness are two sides of the same coin. Well, is it madness so. to see the future? To see the destruction rushing towards us? To understand there is no escape? No hope? No. I am not mad. I'm the only sane one left. I gave him an extra dose of his meds after the attack. <laughs> I can shut him up. Oh, can you imagine? Williams, take us to the spaceport. You can't stop it. Nobody can stop it. Hey, Night is falling. Get out, man. The darkness of eternity. Hush, Manuel. Go lie down. You'll feel better once the medication kicks in. Indeed. Alright, so the other place we can go into is here. Honestly, upgrading on Eden Prime for the minute isn't the biggest deal. You can if you want, but it's not really going to matter to you. There's Nihilus. And who is that? Well, well, well. Saren. Nihilus. This isn't your mission, Saren. What are you doing here? The Council thought you could use some help on this one. I wasn't expecting to find the Geth here. The situation's bad. Don't worry. I've got it under control. Oh, damn. Yep. There it goes, man. Off in the distance. It's a ship. Look at the size of it. Wow. Saying that again. Remember though, I haven't got the best, the uh, best equipment right now. <laughs> Gotta remember that. That's mine. All right, this again. Oh damn! Uh, let's go, sweet. I'm not gonna be able to, am I? Damn it! <laughs> All right, one more time. Easiest way to get in there. Everybody, stay calm out there. We're coming out. We're not armed. Is it safe? Are they gone? You're okay now. Nobody's gonna hurt you. Those things were crawling all around the shed. They would have found us for sure. We owe you our lives. Ah, uh, I still can't believe it. When we saw that ship, I thought it was all over. It showed up right before the attack. We knew it was trouble the second I saw it, so we made a break for the sheds. Tell me everything you remember about the attack. The three of us were working the crops when that ship showed up. We just saw it and ran. I don't know what happened to the rest of the crew. They were by the garage, over near the spaceport, right where that ship came down. No way they survived. You don't know that. We survived. If they made it to the garage, they could have had a fighting chance. Do you know anything about the Prothean beacon they dug up? We're just farmers. We heard they found something out there, but it never really mattered to us. Not until now. What else can you tell me about the ship you saw? I was too busy running to get a clear look at it. I think it landed over near the spaceport. Tell them about the noise, Cole. That awful noise. <laughs> it was emitting some kind of signal as it descended. It sounded like the shriek of the damned. Only it was coming from inside your own head. It was probably trying to block communications. Whatever it was, it felt like it was tearing right through my skull. It almost made it impossible to think. I have to go. Hey, 
Cole, we're just a bunch of farmers. These guys are soldiers. Maybe we should give them the stuff. Jeez, Blake, you've got to learn when to shut up. <laughs> You have something Give to me your me stuff, cold. man. Some guys at the spaceport were running a small smuggling ring. Nothing major. In exchange for a cut of the profits, we let them store packages in our sheds. You're breaking the law, Cole. We're not hurting anybody. Hell, most of the time I don't even know what's in the packages. I just thought there might be something we could use. I found a pistol. Figured it would come in handy if those things came back. But you'll probably get more use out of it than we will. Hand it over and I'll be on my way. So I got the Stinger 3. Get out the way, man. Um, I can probably... Yeah, I probably need to uh, actually upgrade the charm. Uh, soldier in, does health. Let's do some pistol training as well. There we go. I totally forgot that I was saying that like, I oh, don't level up and all that, but kind of need to because then I can't do some of the other stuff here. Uh, okay, that's fine. Let's see what weapons I actually did get real quick. Uh, the Banshee. Uh, no, I don't really use the shotgun too much, so I'm not too bothered. Thing or two, it's fine. It's better than what I've got, so yeah, sure, why not? Alright, that's cool. Now I got the right skills. Damn it! Uh, bye. And down we go. It's quite a cool suit, actually. Pretty decent armor. Commander, it's Nihilus. Oh no. Something's moving over behind those crates. Wait, don't, don't shoot. I'm one of you. I'm human. Sneaking up on us like that nearly got you killed. I am sorry. I was hiding from those creatures. My name's Powell. Oh, okay. I saw what happened to that Turian. The other one shot him. I need to know how Nihilus died. The other one got here first. He was waiting when your friend showed up. He, he called him Saren. I, I think they knew each other. Your friend seemed to relax. He let his guard down. And Saren killed him. Saren, huh? Shot him right in the back. I'm just lucky he didn't see me behind the crates. We were told the Prothean Beacon was brought to the spaceport. What happened to it? It's over on the other platform, probably where that guy Saren was headed. He hopped on the cargo train right after he killed your friend. I knew that beacon was trouble. Everything's gone to hell since we found it. First that damn mothership showed up, then the attack. They killed everyone. Everyone. If I had been behind the crates, I'd be dead too. How come you're the only one who survived? Why didn't anyone else try to hide behind the crates? They never had a chance. I was already behind the crates when the attack started. Wait a minute. You were hiding behind the crates before the attack? Oh, boy. I... Sometimes I need a nap to get through my shift. I... I sneak off behind the crates to grab 40 winks where the supervisor can't find me. You survived because you're lazy? If you hadn't snuck off for that nap, you'd probably be dead just like I all the so, others. I guess so, but... Yeah. Lazy. Yeah, I guess. Lucky. I don't really want to think about it. Um, okay. We need to find that beacon before it's too late. Take the cargo train. That's where the other Turian went. I, I, I can't stay here. I need to get away from all this. That's exactly where I'll be going. Looks like we got a, a little posse of friends. I remember there some, being something over there, so... Just 
they can move, but at least they can move. Oh, throw, sorry. There we go. There you go. And good old Ashley's dead. Take cover, man. some reason he's not taking cover so that's kind of an issue so we're just backing up over here why is he not taking proper cover strange there he is I was doing that Doesn't matter, he's doing it now, so it really matters to me. Just don't want to die, does he? <laughs> before oh. doesn't matter man the fact of the matter is that I I came out on top see like there he did it automatically like what the hell come on don't do this to me Shepard don't do this to me set the charges destroy the entire colony leave no evidence that we were here I think he's uh, seen one too many episodes of Chris Angel Mind Freak. He wants to uh, enter the ma the magician's circle. Do his levitation act. Alright guys, so we are going to leave it here. We've got some bombs to uh, dispose of. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next part real soon guys.